terrible. This is NVIDIA Project Grid. A general purpose foundation model for humanoid robot learning. The group model takes multimodal instructions and past interactions as input and produces the next action for the robot to execute. We developed Isaac Lab, a robot learning application to train Groot on Omniverse Isaac Sim. And we scale out with Osmo, a new compute orchestration service that coordinates workflows across DGX systems for training and OVX systems for simulation. The Groot model will enable a robot to learn from a handful of human demonstrations so it can help with everyday tasks and emulate human movement just by observing us. All this incredible intelligence is powered by the new Jetson Thor Robotics chips, designed for Groot, built for the future. With Isaac Lab, Osmo, and Groot, we're providing the building blocks for the next generation of AI-powered robotics. About the same size. The soul of NVIDIA. The intersection of computer graphics, physics, artificial intelligence. It all came to bear at this moment. The name of that project, General Robotics 003. I know, super good. Super good. Well, I think we have some special guests. Do we? Hey, guys. So I understand you guys are powered by Jetson. They're powered by Jetsons. Little Jetson robotics computers inside. They learn to walk in Isaac Sim. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this, this is orange, and this is the famous green. They are the BDX robots of Disney. Amazing Disney research. Come on, you guys, let's wrap up. Let's go. Five things. Where are you going? I sit right here. Don't be afraid. Come here, Green. Hurry up. What are you saying? No, it's not time to eat. It's not time to eat. I'll give, I'll give you a snack in a moment. Let me finish up real quick. Come on, Green, hurry up. Stop wasting time. This is what we announced to you today. This is Blackwell. This is the platform. Amazing, amazing processors, NVLink switches, networking systems, and the system design is a miracle. This is Blackwell, and this to me is what a GPU looks like in my mind.